Well, it's getting really late. I'm, it's 4 o'clock. I've got to go to bed. i got to get up early, but I took a weird nap at around 7 to about midnight. So, um... But, and I'm getting really tired, but I wanted to make a comment on Limp Loser complimented me saying I lack intellectual vanity just moments, minutes ago. And, uh, um, and I like that compliment. The thing is that, you know, vanity is not something that, okay, you get so much pride, and then it turns into vanity. You know, a lot of pride can lead to vanity, and I have, I have pride, and that can lead to, you know, event, you know moments of hubris. But vanity is a different thing. You can have a vanity in a small amount. You can have no pride and a lot of vanity. And I think it's true that, uh, that that I like vanity and I lack a certain sort of presumption in my knowledge. And that that is related to the fact that I really am just seeking knowledge for myself primarily. I don't have a lot of... Uh, I don't invest a lot of my pride in my ability to prove to others that I'm more you know, more intelligent or I don't think that there's a, a, a some sort of metaphysical ranking of real knowledge versus false knowledge and so even though I prefer my knowledge and I can argue hey this is why I believe this it really essentially is not vain you know even if there's a lot of pride or ego in these other things that, that can be dangerous what allows me to do that you know, I'm making this claim now that I've made it what I'm going to say what allows me to do that is skepticism. Skepticism, this is going to be in episode 3, but it's the philosophy of questions. And if you really focus on questions, and not just the idea that, oh, yeah, but it is the idea that, yay, questions are good, but the idea that, that there is a denial of the duality of questions and answers, that there are just questions which lead to more refined questions, an answer is really just a more refined question. You can state it in the grammar and language as an answer, but it's useful, it's like Newtonian mechanics, we can use that term day to day, it makes sense, it's a certain kind of question, however. It's a question that narrows a previous question. All right, cheers.